And we also got this bud probes all the way from Preston here in Livingham today. Got some kind of octopus here. We still got people setting up. But wonder what is this big white thing? What coming from the camper all the way on the beach? Right then, I'm back out again today. I came out straight after work for this one. Not why I'm still wearing my woolly hat for, and not my baseball cap. Because it was quite nippy this morning. But I came all the way to Livam to have a look at the kite festival. It's right behind me. So it's a big event, and it's happening all weekend here in Livam down on the beach. So let's get straight into the video and see what can we see. Made my way down to the beach area now, and the tide is well out today. Can't even see the sea at all. All what you can see is some good looking kites. You got all your different sizes here. You got your big ones and your small ones, medium ones. It is about two o'clock now, so a lot of people will still be at work. So, I could imagine, probably get a lot more busier as the weekend go on. But to be fair, for something what just nicely started, and not looking too bad. Then it's like a blue line, like a piece of rope stopping you from getting too close. I probably saw people got getting away of people who is flying the kites. But bet you a lot of people do this for a nice hobby. And it's not a bad little hobby, let's be honest. I'm for one can't fly a kite. But when you can fly a big kite like this, then it is incredible, I will say. Got like a camper right there, so you probably here for the weekend now. We've got a handful overly up in the sky, and got some good weather for it today. It's not too windy today, so I'm sort of amazed and keeping up in the air. But other than that, so they're just moving the legs open now, and you can also see they're trying to get the panda up in the air. So we got two food for the price of one, yeah? Even so, it's a free event. Free event. Well, get your words out. Free event. Oh, is it going to be going? I can feel the little breeze now. So is that, is that what they needed to get it up in the air? Oh, it looks like it's going back down, not enough air at the minute, or a bit enough wind to just be able to pick it up. We've got the panda just in the distance. Might well, look like it's getting lost at airing. Got some kind of beach buggy there, probably keeping an eye on everyone. Making sure everyone keeping out in the distance. But yeah, that'd be a nice job drive riding around on the beach and that. That for weather like this. It looked like the panda is on him back now. That is up in the panda being in every direction going so far. And that's it. And we got the octopus in the air now. Yeah, it looked like the panda on the move also. It's a race against time new going up. But well, like what I say, it's incredible how they can fly these. There you go. It, it's not fully, not fully, fully in the air, but it is higher than what it were. So now, 
That's it, probably just wait for a bit of wind to go and it'll be up. Is it going back down again? Yeah. If not, no, I want a little rest. Oh, now we got the bear now. We got a bit of movement in the bear. We got uh, these type of flags flying there, but I suppose this is on a big pole, so you probably don't need a lot of wind to get them going. You also got a kite there. I think it, all the big ones what seem to be having a problem. And then there's a kite up in the air here, what looked like a bird. Let me try to see him in a bit for you. Look at that. <laughs> that is a cool looking looking kite. If I were to walk in with it, you'll think it was like a bird hovering in the sky. We got some flags here and it looked like it all the different countries maybe. What is taking part? We even got some kind of cartoon characters for the little ones. Someone else just got the kite in the air. They were like uh, yanking it up. So it looked like I just had to get some wind behind it and get it up. It looked like a double hand, double handed one that. So yeah. And here is a calendar flag. I do know I have um, a viewer who watched all my videos on calendar. So, here we go. This one is for you, Paul. we also got some other types of flags right here. Even a happy birthday balloon one. And some schools. Some butterflies. And you ask me, they do look good. we got some more kites here. And I've just been speaking to someone from Canada and make their own flags and their own kites by hand and reusable materials. So if kites is your type of thing, I will leave a link to in channel down below. Nice clear blue skies and you can see the odd kite just flying around but well, they meant to always do a nighttime one also so i don't know what that all about but you get kites for the lights on so i might pop down a bit later on tonight to try to capture some of that got so much happening also so not only just a kite festival you got some lights also check this out oh wow and we also got this bud brooks all the way from preston here in living today a big berries wheel also so just coming to the end of this video uh, but I am coming back out tonight so it does like a bit of a start or people waiting for a bit of the wind and just stuff like that but we meant to have like um, lights on the kites at night time I did brought my mum out with me today to check live them out while it's not working so what were your thoughts on this was like like me you haven't been to one of these before haven't you it was all right but it would be better than it would be yeah but hopefully the wind will come later on and tonight we'll be able to see all the kites all lit up in the sky now that will be a good one to watch so please don't forget to hit that like button turn on the blah, 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 blah. no cut. 
don't forget you enjoy this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more videos of Blackpool and the fence and stuff what happening close to Blackpool, then hit that subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, turn on that notification bell and I'll see you on the next one.